Hello, welcome back to NetHack. Da 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 da. So we tried a Valkyrie, we tried a Wizard. I think that this time we're gonna go a little different. I'm gonna do be a Dwarven Archaeologist. So the Archaeologist is not super strong, doesn't have great attributes. Uh, you have kind of a weird starting set of stuff. So our weapon is a bullwhip. We have a leather jacket and a fedora. As an archaeologist, these are things you have to have. Now we do have a pickaxe, very valuable, so we can dig through walls with that. Uh, we come with a bag, a tinning kit, which tinning kit essentially you can make tins out of corpses so the food won't uh, spoil. Touchstone. Touchstone is going to be the key to the strategy we're about to use. Uh, basically, I'm going to attempt what is known as the protection racket. What that entails is we have to get to Mine Town and find a priest at as low of a level as possible. So we don't want to kill anything. We want to let our dog kill everything. So the dog will grow up. And we'll stay at level 1 so that basically you can buy extra points of AC from a priest at 400 gold per AC. Uh, and But if you go up by a level, then it costs way more per, per point of AC. So you want to get there at level 1. And then hopefully, so the touchstone, what we can do with that is we can actually use that to identify gems. So that is going to let us know which gems are worth grabbing and hopefully make us a little rich. So onward and upward. We have a lichen. Let Che take care of that. Oh, yes. See, normally on the... Um, hmm, I have mostly tried the protection racket as a priest, and they start out with a lot of gold since... We aren't starting out or with a lot of gold. We want to do more exploring. We can't go straight directly down because I need to find some gems to make some monies. So, luckily the dog's pretty strong. And he's only going to get stronger as he levels up. Oh, oh. So I did, somebody did a scroll. I don't know what it did. Okay, like in corpse. Large box is locked. Let's break. I can't force. I can't force it open because I only have a bullwhip and you can't force a chest open with a bullwhip. Cool. So, uh, hopefully I'll find a key of some sort or at least like a dagger. I do have a pickaxe. Good point. Good point. Let's wield the pickaxe. And now you'll notice we don't we can just go through walls now. It doesn't matter. Open. It's locked. Let's force it with a pickaxe. A grid bug appears. Nah. Grid bug attacks. Who could have seen that coming? I broke the lock? Hold on. Oh, I opened the lock. Okay, that means I opened it. Oh no, triggered the electricity trap. But it was grounded by something. What's in here? A scroll, a spell book, some potions, one of which is water. Let's see, I have 16 intelligence, so we can try reading the spell book. It, it didn't work. We lost the spell book. Let's drink a milky potion. Plump helmet juice. Why not read the scroll? I don't have anything worth anything. Uh, potion of detect food? Oh, potion of arrows is scroll of detect food. Okay. 
Uh, wield my bull whip so I'm not just breaking through walls. Oh, and I'm blind, so let's wait until I'm not blind so I don't accidentally kill my dog, because my dog's really important to the strategy. Blind, 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 blind. As long as I don't move too fast. I don't want to encounter enemies either, because I don't want to kill any enemies, because then I'll gain... Uh-oh. Grid bug somewhere. I wish I wasn't blind anymore. I could try to pray the blindness away. Oh, excellent. The footsteps of a guard on patrol. That means there's a gold vault somewhere on this level. And we, we can use our pickaxe to get right to it. We're going to get a lot of gold. If I can ever see again in my entire life. If I can ever see again. Hmm. It has been a bunch. Okay, I can see again. There's a jackal tackling me. Okay. Where were we? Oh yes, I want to find that gold vault. Cyan potion. Let's drink it. Magical energies. I got five extra mana. Five extra power. Max power out of that. A chest. It's locked. Let's equip the pickaxe and force it. My dog fell into a pit. Put our bullwhip back on. Open the chest. Two black potions. What's a black potion do? Let's find out. Drink. I feel better. It was a potion of healing and now we have another one. That's good. What? Oh, that's a pit with a corpse at the bottom. Don't be dumb and fall into it. Like my dog did. Wow, I have ten gold. Can you imagine? I'm gonna need, oh. I'm gonna need 400 per point of AC, so. Gonna need more than that. Iron skull cap. And he hap my dog happily picked it up, so I know it's not cursed. I already have a hat. Remove the fedora. So the fedora was giving me no AC at all, so let's wear the skull cap. Gave me one point of AC. That's not my. I have eight AC. That's true. That's really bad. That's tremendously bad. So I don't want to get hit. You'll just see. I just got hit for. Oh boy. Yeah. So the goblin stabbed me with its dagger. Got me to 2 HP. Luckily, my dog intervened and killed it before I died. I'm going. You be very cautious. And oh, there's a kobold. Dog's taking care of it. I'm just trying to be low key and let my HP come back. Wait, wait. My dog's wasting all of his support, picking up darts. Hungry. I'll eat a lichen corpse and another. Eat both lichen corpses. Okay, so let's get to finding this here hidden gold vault, huh? Okay, I just got teleported right into it. That's convenient. And we escape before the guards show up. But I'm away from my dog, and that's very risky. Wield bullwhip. No, 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 no. Wield the pickaxe, because I want to dig my way to the dog. Huh? I'm being followed by a, a newt. The deadly attack newt. Help. Help, Che. Okay. My dog will eat the newt. And I'll 
equip a bull whip. Okay, so I have 729 gold. That's an amount. That's not zero. Gemstones are going to be more plentiful once I find the mines, probably. But onwards and downwards, I guess. I found the gold vault. What have we here? We've got a silver ring, some money, not much. Coach Z's got money, but not much. Lichen, let my dog handle that. Fountain. Two food rations. Delicious. Oh, and uh... Looks like a chaotic altar. I'm lawful, so we'll have to we would have to make sacrifices on it to even be able to make use of it. Like you have to convert it to be a friendly altar. Kick down this door here. A rat. The rat got hit by an arrow trap. Okay, there's a ooh, hidden door. Do I have intrinsic searching? That'd be pretty cool, huh? Intrinsics. No, you don't get that until level 10. I don't know how I found that hidden door. I'll take it. Uh, I got a wand, an oak wand. I hear somebody counting gold coins. That means there's a shop somewhere on this level. Let's see if we can find out what the wand is. You... It's a wand of lightning, Elbreath. Ah, oh, it's gonna fucking make me blind. What if I just cancel? Okay. You can write with a wand of lightning quickly and inscribe with it, but it, the flash of it makes you blind. Okay. So there's our down stairs. I want to see what's the sh up at the shop. Whoa, oh, I killed a jackal. Okay, that's fine. I only got 2 HP. It's fine. Or XP. Not enough to level up. I have to be careful with these locked doors, because if one of them says, like, this is a shop that's closed for business, and I kick it down, I am basically dead. Come kill this newt for me, dog. I can't handle newts. Got a cream pie. Shh, don't even. Don't even. Okay, I got a splint mail, and the dog happily steps on it, so. It's not cursed. So let's remove leather jacket. Wear splint mail. F drop leather jacket. Drop fedora. Why am I stressed? What is so heavy that I'm carrying? A splint mail, I guess, is just... It's a plus one, too, but I guess it's just too heavy. So... Don't want to be stressed. If you're stressed, then every turn is taking, like, three or four turns, and things can just run up on you and murder you. So, I guess I'm back in the leather jacket at AC8. I'm being cornered by many jackals. I hope my dog kills them and now rats. I'm beginning to feel weak. Oh, because I didn't eat and I'm hungry. I'm going to eat one of my rations. Okay. The fun thing, I have rations. I also picked up that cream pie, which you can eat or you can throw it at somebody. And they'll be blinded. Because that's net hack for you. They think of all the interactions that things can do. Doors locked. Moon's haunted. Where is that door? I mean, shop. It's not here. Or uh, it's probably not over there. So that leaves over here. Wow. Okay, so well, we got a mine entrance somewhere. Still no shop. I'm kind of I'm using the search function here, trying to find hidden doors. Hidden doors along the walls. 
think there's a shop. Okay, Lycan. Che grows into a dog, so he leveled up big enough to become a new class of monster. Getting to feel hungry. Eat a, another ration. I feel agile. I feel tough. I'm getting all kinds of things. Wield pickaxe. I don't really want to accidentally break into a store. I found a little gold. 33 in the wall there. Oh uh, no. Okay, so just kind of aimlessly using the pickaxe like a dummy. I'm hoping to break across a path to the store, not the store itself. Got a little bit more gold there. I hear the footsteps of a guard on patrol. Oh, maybe I misheard. Maybe there is, in fact, a gold vault here. I'm getting a good amount of gold here. A gray stone. Oh, that's just from digging, probably. Hmm. Yeah, I want to say there's a gold vault. The footsteps of a guard on patrol. Oops, accidentally killed another jackal. It's fine. This is basically, in my opinion, you can trace a direct path between this and Minecraft, uh, unironically, this mining mechanic. Um, okay, so I got a black gem. This is the first time we try the touchstone, so we're going to try to use our touchstone on black gem, a worthless piece of black glass that identifies it. Okay, so fuck that glass. But sometimes it'll be a valuable thing. Footsteps of a guard in patrol. Ugh, killed a zombie. Stop killing things. I don't want to kill things. It's a 4x4 four four vault that we're looking for, so... There's a lot of places it could be. And I got separated from my dog, and I don't really want that. Uh, the dog doesn't have super far vision in the dark tunnels. It kind of goes to where it thinks you last went. Oh boy. I'm being chased by jackals. I'm less... Oh, my dog showed up. Okay. Dog, help me. No. I fought the lichen instead of the actual mobile enemy. I'll do a little swoop de doop here. Woo, okay. Got around them. Okay. I'm safe. I missed the newt. I'm beginning to feel weak. I'm very hungry, huh? It's because my dog is eating all the people and I'm futzing around a lot. Ugh. I really need to be on more on the ball with this HP. XP. I am finding a lot. Of, oh, yay, there it is. Oh, that was a really valuable vault, too. And the guards didn't catch me. The guards catch you, you have to lie to them and tell them that they're you're the owner of the vault, Croesus. And then they'll leave you trapped, supposedly trapped in it, but if you have a pickaxe, you can get out. Um, okay, so hopefully this is the way to the mines. 24 divided by 4 is 6. So I can buy 6 points of AC from the protection racket. Wow, this floor isn't the mines, but there's some stuff going on. A kobold, two potions, another potion. There's something underneath it. A bell and a two-handed sword. 
I wonder what weapons the archaeologist is professional profession and probably not much good. Oh, peck axe, saber, boomerang, and whip. So silver saber would be the ideal thing that we want to find, but those are so rare. Okay. Che, why are you running away, bro? I need you to kill this kobold. Take an interest, thank you. Okay. A bell. Take the bell, why not? Let's ring it. Ring, ring, ring. It's nothing. Um, potions. A scroll. I don't have anything too valuable. Let's read the scroll. A scroll of teleportation. A.K.A. when I'm... Oh, a scroll of danger. But here, there's these iron bars, so I know that the scroll behind that is another scroll of teleportation. And a green elf corpse. Apparently an elf got stuck back there. Scroll of teleportation is very good for when you're in danger. But also, I'm without my doggy. Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. I'll pick it up, and I'll eat it right away if it's going to be so heavy. An apple, a day, another bell? Two bells on one floor. Can you believe it? Okay, let's quaff some of these potions just to be able to carry more stuff. Golden potion. Oh, we got a bookstore up here selling scrolls. Selling scrolls. That's a good one. We'll come back. We'll come back because I want to. I think my dog's been picking up a lot of stuff. So once I'm able to. We'll be back. Trust me. Now let's. What else? Um, the cloth. An orange potion. Moving faster. Potion of speed. Feel tough. A uh, potion of raisability. Yellow potion. Oh, a potion of self knowledge or whatever. I'm hallucinating. Well, I'm fucking hallucinating now. Um, I can safely pray. My awareness renormalizes. hate hallucinating. Can prayer cure hallucination? No, I reckon I can't solve that. I can't just wait. It's oh, it's annoying to wait because it thinks that your pet might be a monster but you also don't want to kill your pet okay you know what I'm going to do I can dig through the walls and get some money I'm going to dig through the walls oh, that thing's being mean I need my dog to protect me please M to force my dog is useless I think okay so it did something there you know what actually what I want to do no I don't want to do that do I to go upstairs without the dog right next to me so I can go upstairs without it so I can try to wait out these hallucinations but then there's the problem is I don't want to actually fight stuff this run has got complicated quickly I'm going to just continue just digging through the walls for money I guess
And that there will be a gem. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe it's just nothing, I guess. Okay, I got a spell book. I don't want to read that while hallucination. I got another scroll of teleportation. I'm just still hallucinating away as my dog walks behind me, turning into all manner of horrible creatures. Oh, almost, I keep almost hitting the dog because he gets in front of me. That's why I hate hallucinations. door is locked. What if I go through the wall? Doesn't matter, does it? Uh, 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 oh, 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 oh. I'm hungry. I'm going to eat an apple. I can't eat what? I can't eat an apple. Core dumped. Wow, what a funny Unix joke. Nothing for it. I'll eat another cream or a full ration, actually. Okay. Oh, I'm done hallucinating. Okay, onward and upward is what I always say. Uh, fox. Okay, thank you for saving me from the fox. Let's go to the mines. The goblin. Help. Okay, dog. Uh, fox. I'm hurt. Che growed up into a large dog. He's getting a lot of XP, even though I have managed to not level up. I killed a lichen. I'm really close to leveling up. I really can't kill anything else. Where's my dog? Ring the bell. The dog can hear it, hopefully, and he comes. Dog. Okay, there he is. Come on. Let's go up this way. Okay, come on, dog. <sighs> We've been gnomed. Oh, grateful. Downstairs, we're right next to the upstairs again. if I had a light. Studded leather armor, that sounds good. I don't know if it's cursed. My dog doesn't seem to want... Okay, dog stepped on it with no problem. Yes, remove B, drop my leather jacket, wear leather armor. Brought my AC down a little bit. Um... But I'm still in cupboard. Why am I so weak? I can't carry anything. Drop my fedora since I'm not wearing it. Drop my tinning kit because I barely use those. Now I'm unencumbered, so that's good. What is right there? Barbarian corpse. So a trap. What killed this barbarian? No way to know. I'm away from my doggy, but I can dig a hole to him. 
I got a lot of money in the wall. There's always money in the wall. I can now get by seven points of AC from the protection racket. Come on, dog. Follow me this way. Oh, I killed a gecko. I, oof. 18 XP I have. Pretty damn close to leveling up. I'm almost certain. Blinded and deaf. That's not what I want to be. I'm going to pray. Yes. Quetzalcoatl's well pleased, but he didn't do anything for me. I'm still blind and deaf. Shit. And in danger. This is when you read your scroll of teleportation. I shuddered for a moment. Was It must have been like cursed? Read my other scroll of teleportation. There, now I'm in another location. Oh, but I'm blind and deaf, so I can't... I don't know what's around me. Something... There's a monster around me. Okay, so what you can also do with the pickaxe is you can... Dig. Downward. getting zapped is it grid bugs I'm in a pit oh cuz I dug a pit that's probably why a e downwards I can see again I am surrounded by grid bugs I'm gonna drink my potion of healing I'm in a pit crawl yeah okay so I'm out of the pit that I made for myself so what you're uh, what you're supposed to be able to do if you dig down is go to another floor down. Let's try that again. Down. It's the fucking bug it keeps interrupting me. be nice if I would just stumble upon the way out, huh? Black gem. Take that for testing. Okay, I may have lost the grid bug, or it may still be following me. I found my dog. Oh! Stone. Okay, I was worried that was a ghost. I just can't see it. Okay. Not a ghost. Not a ghost. That's good. A dwarvish cloak. I think I saw Chase stepping on it. Dwarvish cloak. Wearing it. Okay, well, I got my dog back to protect me from the mean bugs. bag. What's in the bag? A wand. I... Oh, the bag. It's an empty bag. It's very heavy. Let's see. Engrave with my wand to identify. Elbereth. Ice cubes. Name. Uh, so we know that the tin wand is a wand of cold. So that's cool. We got two offensive zappy ones. We just don't want to ever use them until we have done the protection racket successfully. Trouble lifting a potion. It's so... Oh, the heavy potion. Let me drink my heavy, heavy potion. It makes me feel good. Restore ability. 